the final act of traitor Aaron Keener was to activate his rogue network. Across the US, agents loyal to his cause activated, sapping the division's resources and attention. Amid the chaos that followed, Black Tusk commander Barden Schaefer made a play for New York, rallying rogue agents embedded with the outcasts, Rikers, hyenas, and true sons. Schaefer had become too powerful a threat to ignore. The division hunt down and neutralize him, but find he was following someone else's orders. Former New York acting commander Fei Lau had turned her back on the division and was now working with the Black Tusk. Fei is entrusted by the mercenary group's mysterious owner, Natalia Sokolova, with guarding their most valuable asset, President Ellis. When intel shows that Lau is at Camp White Oak with Ellis, the division move in. But they arrive to find a shocking scene. Fei Lau has assassinated the president and blamed the division for it. Left with no choice, the agents are forced to kill Fei Lau. Nobody felt her betrayal and her loss harder than Kelso. Why had her former comrade turned her back on the division? What was her mission? And can the division survive what comes next? <laughs>